Hello, this is Netmug here with the new series. Um, it's a series I've been waiting forever to play. I'm here with Net Solos in the same room. But How are you doing, guys? We're not going to have a lot of commentary because I'm going to get wrapped up in the story of the game. You probably don't know what it is already because of the uh, what's currently displayed, but you'll you'll figure it out. But yeah, this will be limited commentary. Because like I said, I'll be wrapped up in a story. Ned Solos will either be watching or just doing his thing. So yeah, enjoy. Welcome to Assassin's Creed Rogue. You're gonna enjoy this. Stay my blade from the flesh of the innocent. Hide in plain sight. Never compromise the assassin brotherhood. These are the tenets of the creed. The principles I used to live by. I was a young man then. The Seven Years' War was about to begin. I could not have what the future had in store for me, nor the cost I would choose to do. My name is Shane Patrick Cormac. This is my story. Beautiful. Let's get this underway. You ready, Matt Solos? I'm ready, man. Precious little to show for it. Or had you been spending it all getting out of trouble? Well, you know, trouble just follows me around. Let's head back. Come on. Captain Deliver Andre and his crew must have run into some trouble. Who knew making with smugglers would lead to no good? I still don't understand why you can't tell me what we're doing here. Because Chevalier decided not to tell you. I thought we were friends, Liam. We are. But this is business. It doesn't concern you, Shane. Yeah. <laughs> 
You're going too fast for you. I'm just keeping an eye on you in case you fall down and hurt yourself. What happened here? My men were attacked by some English sea dogs. Why, Captain Joseph, couldn't you fight them all off by yourself like you're always saying? It is Capitaine Louis Joseph Gauthier, Chevalier de la Verandrie. And you are dreaming if you think any training could make you into a proper assassin. Do you even know what that means? It means being responsible for an ancient and proud tradition. It means obeying your mentor without question. How else will we ensure freedom for the human race? That's pretty words, Chevalier. But I don't feel too free at the moment. Well then, feel educated! I will teach you some manners. supposed to meet have been taken prisoner. Say and I'll free those smugglers. You treat her wounded. Take these. You'll need them. Take with care, Shay. The Royal Navy be ready for us. Remember your training. Then you can teach him a lesson. They don't stand a chance. Where are you mates right. now, you filth rat? Well done, Mug. I was saving those feathers for you. Very thoughtful. Maybe you are not completely useless, Shake. Speaking of useless, those blockheads won't be needing this vessel anymore. This pile of mail. You want her, Shay? She is yours. Now bring me back to my ship. Dick. You heard, Chevalier? This vessel is yours, Shay. Come on. Take the wheel. Some of the men you rescued agreed to join us. A good crew. I'm not so certain that the captain. ship so quickly. Next to me, you're the most experienced sailor in the Brotherhood chain. Besides, we could use another vessel, even this beautiful one. My age. Your own pile of garbage, yes? Wow, what a With a, a little paint and a few new cannons, she'll look as fine as anything on the seven seas. 
Shall we begin? Fireballs, man. Ripple waves. That's so cool. Underneath the Morgan. Morgan? That silly fairy queen to rule Merlin, the wise? Morgan was an old goddess. The queen of war and darkness. She harvested the swords of fallen warriors. Perfect indeed. A ship. shanties i'm actually very satisfied that's actually one of my favorite chances right there what course would you have me set shane time to report back to the mentor wouldn't you agree wise words captain wise words assassin's creed rogue there you have it Leave a like if you enjoyed this video, share it with your friends, you know, comment, do all that stuff. Um, oh wait, there's more. What the hell did you do? It's some kind of dormant virus? Shit, hang on, I'm getting you out of there. <sighs> Sorry for the rough exit. He's working, check. You were just an anonymous. Animus, yes? You were using it to access a genetic memory file that Helix labeled Shea Cormac? You worked for Abstergo Entertainment, remember? Any of this ringing a bell? Your session triggered something bad and it's affecting the whole building. We need to find your boss. You haven't forgotten your boss, have you? Melanie LeMay, zipper, chipper, overachiever? Here. Take your communicator, check if you got lost. Now let's get out of here. Follow me. Double time. This chaos is absolutely your fault, in case you're wondering. Well, jeez, don't be such a bitch about it. Come on, everyone. Just like we practiced in our safety drills. Everything is going to be okay, guys. Stay positive. Dang, is that Nakia phone armor? Jesus Christ, dude. Advanced warfare armor or some shit? Bitch, if you don't calm the fuck, if you don't calm the fuck down, you little shit. I will take my time as I want. Looks like I get to. Uh, so I guess you. right here we're. Come with me if you want to live. Well, yeah, because it's IRL. Who cares about these scenarios? As I don't. They suck dick. What the hell is happening? A file labeled Shea Cormac was booby trapped with some kind of virus. Your job is to prevent things like this. We need to contain these genetic memories, then we can destroy them. No. I Nipple salad. Them. I want to study these memories. But. With respect, Miss Fillet, this is not a request. You heard the man. Fine. I need to borrow your numbskull. Is that okay with you, Ms. LeMay? Hey there, this might seem a bit weird, but you're gonna work for contractors we hire to, you know, upgrade our security. Mr. Otto Berg and Ms. Violet DeCosta. Call me Violet. 
I have to go check on our people and prepare a statement for the press. Well, her name's Violet. They call us this. Why don't you call her Violet? I mean, <laughs> it's her first name. Why wouldn't you call it her? Do they call me Violet? Technically, you're it's not her first name, you dumbass. Why wouldn't I call you Violet? Like so I think it's only fair. What am I gonna call you, violin? Mr. Berg wants us to relive shades. Look at you. You dress like a slut. You know that? You dress like a slut, you dirty little shit. I bet you look dick in your face all the time. Man, oh, great. A fucking power out of you. Ooh, not only does it restrict our access to the cloud. Wi Fi. Ah, uh, who cares? It's adapted to fuck up the other operating systems. Wait, who's fucking who? Who's fucking who? Elevators are out of commission. Are we stuck on this floor? Damn, yes. I'll get a repair crew on site ASAP. There's a working area server on this floor. I guess it'll have to do for now. Thank you, Mikasa. I want regular updates on your progress with Shay's genetic memories. Why? He's just a nobody as far as I can tell. If Shay Cormac is who I suspect he is, then this temporary setback may provide us with an unexpected reward. Proceed to the server room on this floor. You're not gonna follow me? You're a whore, dude. I'm so disappointed. Ooh, yellow screen, I like. Do you see a flashing wireless thing? What the fuck is this shit? In theory, if you align the beams to segments of the core, it should solve the problem. What is up with these stupid puzzles? You have to move the circles in such a way that each segment is powered by a beam. The keyword here is each. One beam and one beam only per core segment, okay? Once everything is lit up properly, the system will reboot. Got it? Give it a shot. I thought you shut your fucking mouth and did a tramp. Good job. This car wasn't too complex. But we moved into advanced hardware in the rest of the building will require more work. Whoa, do I have to actually do this? God. The assassin of the Pali believed that Al-Muadi was a great mentor of the year of the mountain. <coughs> and that he schemed with the Templars to acquire a I see instead a shrewd and cunning leader. A man who used his best assassin. Al Dair ibn Lahad to eliminate his conspirators in order to keep the apple for himself, so that he could use it to enforce world peace. While it must be stated unequivocally that Al Muali was not a Templar, it is interesting to me that his vision of peace was more in line with Templar philosophy than assassin. In the past, both sides had the same goal, that of peace. Our only difference was how we chose to achieve it. Had Al Muali not been killed by Altair and allowed to carry out his plan, perhaps we would not be fighting now. It was only after Altair reformed the Brotherhood with its new ideals of free will that the conflict truly escalated and spread across the planet. For if the so called wise man of the mountain can see things from our point of view, surely the same can be said for other assassins. God damn it, Altair. Why do you gotta fuck everything up, fucking lord? Sorry if I insulted any Altair fans. Uh, okay. So, I'm not sure you're supposed to see that. Just, uh, you should just get back to your animus. Uh, you should just go back to being a fucking Look, slut. Look, back online, you could, in theory, restore your co-workers' workstations if you, you know, if you like being helpful. And you could, in theory, yeah, find child, a game to play. if you, you know, you like being sneaky. Badass. Hey, one of your co-workers dropped his communicator by the elevator. If you see any tech lying around like that, grab him. There might be a clue as to who did this. Okay, can you... Now that you have unlocked Shakespeare... Bring your shit off! We stand on the brink of a grand discovery. Oh my god, is that a Far Cry poster? I know you must have questions about your new assignment. Or about me. For now. All I will say is that Shay's story contains the answers. Far Cry 3, Far Cry 3. Far Cry 3, Far Cry 3. Far Cry 3. Assassin's Creed Rising Phoenix. What the fuck is this bullshit? I'm fucking done. Alright, leave a like if you enjoy. 
um, comments if you have any suggestions for any other series besides this one. I'll be keeping this one going to the absolute end. I know I canceled AC4 because the story isn't all that great, but I will be continuing AC2 in the near future. AC Rogue is going to be going all the way to the end, non-stop, full throttle. So leave a comment if you enjoy, like it, share it with your friends, and maybe even give me a subscribe. Hey, I'm just trying to get some hits out there. All right, so this is Netbug signing off, and Net Solos too. Bye. <laughs> yeah, bye. Stay bitchy, everyone.